What's going on guys, it's MB Soul 716 and uh, this is my, I, I guess you could call it my Kicksify episode. This is the episode where I'm going to show you all my uh, kicks for sale, and they're all up on my Kicksify store, link is in the, in the description, I can't talk today, sorry, so if you, you catch me stuttering or something, leave it be, but uh, first, if you get the East Bay Magazine, um, in the most recent one with the uh, Jordan 29 cover, you might have got these. They're two little posters. This one's a little uh, vertical one. They're in the uh, center of the magazine. It's a little nice one. You get that one and then you get this bigger one. I, d I just wanted to show you guys this really quick because I thought it was kind of cool. Incredibly light for superior flight. Um, I don't know. Just something free a free Jordan poster I mean you can't really go wrong with that but uh I thought it was pretty cool so uh, if you get those magazines um, definitely take those out and hey hang them up somewhere or something but uh for my first pair for my Kicksify store I'm gonna I have two pairs that do not have boxes it's a pair of Jordan 15 SEs in the uh, USA colorway so I'm gonna do these first as you can see, they are a little beat up. Um, I have these up for, I believe, like 70. I think they're up for $70. As you can see, there's some discoloring on the toe, a little bit of creasing, but it's not really bad. Um, what else is going on here? There's a little bit of scuffing right there. It's not really that bad. I mean, these are really old shoes. I think these came out in like 2006. That's for the left shoe. We'll go to the right shoe. Uh, a little bit more creasing, as you can see. I think this one, there was sole separation, as you can kind of, if you can compare. See how this is a little bit further apart, but I did get that back together. Um, it should be good for a while. This one, same situation, a little bit of creasing on the toe. A uh, couple scuffs on the back, same situation as the other one. And then I'm gonna go to my second pair. These these two pairs are the only ones that don't have boxes. I'm gonna go to my uh, LeBron 4s in Midnight Blue. These I believe I have up for 140 with $20 shipping. Like I said, everything in this video is up on my Kicksify store and that link will be in the description. So definitely check that out. I have some great deals. Uh, yeah, most of it's in a size, most of the stuff size 13, but I have, um, I think I only have one pair in a size 11. So if you're a 13, this is perfect for you. Um, if you like the pair in a size 11, yeah, check that out. Hell, I don't know. But uh, these are these are actually really clean. If you saw my video of me unboxing these, um, I did clean them up. They look a lot better from compared to when I got them. But uh, only thing really wrong with them that I would that's even noticeable is uh this little shit on the toe this is for the this is the right shoe it's a little messed up on the toe Here, and this is the left shoe it's not as bad on the left and uh for both shoes if you can see in the light there's like some like little scratches on the inner side of the shoe that's for the left shoe and this is the right shoe if you can see that some of it's creasing, some of it is scratches. Uh, it really isn't that bad though. But yeah, those are a great bang for your buck. But yeah, if you're interested in those, check those out. Hit me up on my Kicksfest store. Send me a message if you want to nego negotiate. I can't talk, like I said. If you want to negotiate on prices, just hit me up. We'll see what we can do. And then for my third pair, these come in the box. A pair of KD6s. Retail was, what was the retail on these? 130, KD6, size 13. I'm gonna take these out of the box. They are the uh, KD6 Christmases. Only reason I'm selling these is I have, uh, I have a few pairs of Christmas shoes and I figured why not just sell a pair. Um, these I, I bought brand new. I only wore them twice I think. Worn twice, 
really nice shoe, really comfortable. I, uh, I don't know. They're just not really my style. But uh, as you can see, the midsole has, I'm going to try to get the focus going. It's not really, there we go. There's like no creasing where like the foam is on the midsole, not at all. Like you've seen a lot of KDs. Oh, there's a little bit right there, but uh, it's nothing really noticeable. Really clean sole. I kept these. I washed them every time I wore them, and uh, kept them really clean. The only creasing is right there, if you can see on the uh, on the toe. That's just where your foot bends. I mean, you're gonna see that in a pair of KD sixes. Same sh situation on the uh, left shoe. Um, everything is like new. No creasing except for right on the toe, but uh, super clean. They come with the original ornaments. Uh, I think I have these up for 170 with uh, what is it? 170 with $20 shipping. But uh, like I said, I'm willing to negotiate on anything I have here. Uh, so just hit me up on there or hit me up on YouTube, whatever. Now these you might, I, I never even made a video of these, so, but these I know I made a video of, and I'm sure you might have, you know, I don't know if you've seen them, but you might have seen them, but uh, I bought these a little while back, they are my Nike Blazer Mid Dharma Initiative, i take both out so I can show both to you, there we go, these I kept super clean absolutely like 100% clean as you can see the laces aren't dirty whatsoever sure they're like flipped a little bit that's just from me relacing them they are the original SB laces there's no creasing right here um, they, they just look super new like even the midsoles not even dirty the actual sole isn't dirty I wore these I only wore these like a few times see the heel there's a little bit of dirt there Super clean though. There's no fading on the uh, original Nike SB tag on the front. On the back it says shoe. That's for the left shoe. And then we'll go to the right shoe. Same situation. Very clean. Almost no creasing. There's like a little bit of something right there. A little bit of creasing, but I mean, that's not even noticeable. Again, super clean on the right shoe. No dirt on the back, it says shoe right there. And again, no fading on the Nike SB tag. Uh, these I think I have up for, I wanna say I have them up for like 120. I'm probably wrong though, because I put these up a while ago. And uh, I'm trying to figure out how to, uh, I'm just gonna throw these in for now. I'll move them around later when I'm done with the video. But uh, I wanna say I have these up for 120 with $20 shipping. I could be wrong, go check it out, uh, hit me up if you have any offers, I'm actually going to move these down here, here I'll pull this chair out, there we go, I'll move these down here, so I have some room to mess around, alright, for the next for the next pair I have a pair of Jordan 1's, Jordan 1 fat, retail was $105, these I did wear a little bit, but they look super good, great condition, um, so I'm just going to open it. They are the Jordan 1 Bordeaux's. I bought these a few years ago, and I didn't really like them that much. I wore them a few times, but, uh, a few times. I just said I wore them a lot. I, I wore them a good amount. I'll say it like that. I wore them a good amount. There is some creasing. We'll do the uh, left shoe first. As you can see, there is a little bit of creasing. Look at it from the side. It's not all that bad, this is canvas. They come with the original inserts, which you can see right there. Original everything, laces. I relaced these so it looks really clean. Um, I kept the midsole very clean. I kept the actual sole very clean. Sure, there's a little bit of gunk and shit right there, but I mean, it's the sole, you're gonna see that. But this shoe in general, it's very, very clean. Um, I. I don't know, <laughs> but I think I have these up for, um, I want to say 70 with $10 shipping, that sounds right, I think I have them up for like 70 bucks, 
with ten dollars shipping. But uh, same situation on this right shoe. Very clean. I kept these super clean. I'm just showing you the midsole. This one, the creasing isn't as bad, but it's still there. You can still see it, but still a very clean shoe. See on the back, extremely clean. But yeah, if you're interested in those, I'm willing to barter with everything I show you guys here. Um, so just all you got to do is message me on YouTube or Instagram, or not Instagram, on Kixify or Instagram. You know my Instagram at MB Souls. Or you can look up MB Soul 716. Actually, I'm not going to show these right now. I'll do these later. Uh, move this over. These I know I showed a video of. Um, hit me up if you're interested in these. I know they come in a LeBron box. These are not a pair of LeBrons. I'm going to try to peel this off. Because this is how the guy shipped it when I originally bought it. But uh, I might try to take that off. If it ruins the box, I won't. But uh, if I everything I ship here, if I sell to you, it will be double boxed. I will not do this shit. I'm not. That's just something you don't do. I find that really messed up. But uh, I'm gonna try to open this LeBron box. Uh, there we go. Okay. Now I have a video of these. Um, these are a really nice shoe. I did clean them up. Not to the fullest extent, but they are really clean. Well, they're not. No, I'm sorry. I should not say that. They're really nice, not clean. They are dirty. They are all suede. So, I mean, some pieces. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. I had to, <laughs> I had to hang up on that really quick. But yeah, these are super nice. Um, a little bit of creasing as you can see on the toe box this is the left shoe a little bit of shit on the toe box this is all suede i had trouble getting anything out on, the, on these um yeah midsole is really nice the actual sole is really nice too as you can see it's really clean um midsole is very clean laces are almost like brand new they cut they do come with the original uh spare laces they're like a uh, they're a bright red to match this uh, Nike SB right here on the tongue. These are the mids. I don't know. I'm not really into dunks, so I don't know a lot about them. But uh, as you can see, they look pretty decent. I want to say I have these up on Kicks 5 for, I want to say like 65 with $10 shipping. I have to go check, but uh, hit me up and uh, let me know if you're interested. I'm going to show you guys the right shoe now. It's going to be the same situation on the right shoe. Clean midsole. As you can see, clean actual sole. Everything I've showed you guys is a size 13 so far. These are a size 13. Um, sorry, I just popped the uh, toe box in, but the creasing is not all that bad on this one. As you can see, there's no insert, so I can just like push that in. Um, laces are very clean. Actually, says Nike SB on the tongue but yeah really nice shoe kind of like a grape colorway but yeah hit me up if you're interested interested in those Sorry, I'm closing this really awkwardly all right hit me up if you want those uh, on my Kixify message me YouTube all that shit these are the uh, pair of size 13 or size not size 13 size 11s that I have I'll show those at the end next I'm gonna get into these pair of Reeboks. They come with the original tag. Reebok Reserve. Um, let me try to get this up. There we go. Uh, Kamikaze 2 mids, size 13. Men's. Made in Vietnam. Cargo green and black. Um, you might already know these. They are the Kamikaze 2 Rainmans. Uh, really nice shoe. Really, they kind of remind me of boots. And that's to me anyway <laughs> but uh they remind me of boots they're really like big shoes these are uh in pretty nice condition i mean sure there's some creasing right here on the midsole but i mean they're fairly clean this is the left shoe fairly clean shoe i don't think i'm selling these for much i want to say like 80 dollars shipped 
Um, sorry. There we go. Uh, a little bit of crease. Oh, a little bit of crease. And there's a pretty good amount of creasing on the toe box all around it. It's going to be the same situation on the uh, right shoe. I mean, I did wear these. Literally, I wore these for baseball, and then I just cleaned them up. There's a lot of creasing on the back. But, I mean, if you're interested in these, it'll be a cheap pair of shoes, something to just rock around. Really good basketball shoes. I never really wore them for basketball because I enjoy uh, older Jordans for basketball. So you can see there's more creasing on the midsole. Uh, and the toe, there's kind of like these threads. Because threads go in here, and they're kind of like ripped, I suppose. I might try to clean these up a little bit more before I sell them or ship them out to you. But, uh, yeah. More creasing there. More creasing on this, on the side, and on the back. If you want these, uh, hit me up. Let me know. I might lower the price. I probably will lower the, lower the price. But uh, just check them out. Check out the pictures. Very detailed pictures. All right, now I'm running out of room on this chair, so I'm gonna have to put these down here. There we go. All right, these I am actually, I, I, I am selling, but I don't know if I wanna sell them, but I am selling them. They are for sale. All right, look at the side. Uh, there we go. It's a Barkley Posit Max, size 13, in metallic silver gamma blue. These are the uh, Barkley Posit Pure Platinums or the Gamma Blues. Um, really nice shoes. Um, they don't really fit my feet too well because I have extremely wide feet. So I usually, I don't know. I, I wear these. I wore these a lot though, as you can see on the on the sole. But I kept them really clean. As you can see, they're just glowing with this uh, whole Pure Platinum type finish. Really clean. These are glow in the dark. Well, the sole is glow in the dark. Uh, I haven't tested it in a while. What is this? The right shoe. Um, this the right shoe. The only flaws with the right shoe is um, there's a little bit of paint chipping down here. It's nothing big. It hasn't spread or anything. It's just stayed like that. Um, so it's nothing serious. And uh, I think there's some scratches somewhere on this one. I'm looking. Hold on. Where are the scratches? Oh yeah, there's one scratch right here, if you can see that. I'm gonna try to get that to focus. Yeah, it's close enough. And I think that might be it. Oh no, there's some little scratches right here. You can kind of see it with the light. It's nothing serious. It's not even noticeable when you're wearing them. But uh, I just thought I'd get that out there so you guys know what you're buying. Uh, this doesn't have any paint chips along the silver midsole. Sorry. Um, again, the uh, sole is yellowed. I did wear these a good amount. And on these, nothing is. There's no scratches or anything on the toe box whatsoever. But there are scratches right here. If you can see them, I'm sure you can. Going, they're vertical scratches. They're kind of going along this Nike swoosh also but again it's nothing serious they still look great on foot great shoes they're obviously not shoes to ball in but a uh, great casual shoe put these back in the box oh shit there we go but yeah great shoes I think I have these up for 180 with uh, $20 shipping uh, go check them out detailed pictures on my kicks pie uh, definitely hit them up yeah great shoes I might actually buy another pair later in life I already reviewed those so now these are for my uh, size 11 they are the question mids in a size 11 as you can see in a sorry it's not focusing but it says Reebok Royal white Reebok red See, it's got an Iverson box, and they are the Question Mid Draft Picks. These are very clean shoes. They're actually not mine, they're my buddies, but I'm selling them for them. And, uh, I think I have these up for, 
I want to say I have them up for like 110 shipped. If that's 90 with $20 shipping, I might have them lower than that. I got to check. But uh, as you can see, the suede on these, that was weird. The suede on these is really clean. He wore, he only wore them, I think he only wore them like three times. Because me and him are good friends. I always recognize what shoes he's wearing. And uh, I already sold his breads. I had I had his bread fours, but I sold them for like $190, which is great, in my opinion. Uh, really clean midsole on these. Super clean actual sole. The sole, it's an icy sole. It's not even yellowed. It's very light yellowing. So you can tell he only wore them a few times. The suede on these looks great. Or well, it's not suede, it's new buck. Looks great. This is the right shoe. So we'll go to the left shoe. Same situation, very clean midsole. And these uh, air pockets are clear. Uh, there's a little bit of shit right there, if you can see that on the uh, sole. But I mean, that's the sole, you're not gonna see them when you're wearing them like that. Um, the other side of the midsole. Again, very clean. Very nice. Very clean new buck. Uh, looks great. Got the silver Q. And then you got the, uh, let's see if you can. I've never had a pair of these, so these are kind of weird for me. Uh, you got the red Reebok symbol on the uh, on the tongue. Same situation for these. But uh, yeah, I might actually buy a pair of these if I can find a pair of my size. But uh, yeah, I should have uh, a couple new pickups coming in, hopefully this week. We'll, we'll have to see. But yeah, these are all the shoes I have up on my Kixify. As you can see, there's six boxes there and there's a couple boxes right there. Uh, and then you got these two pairs and this pair. So I got like, I got like 10 pairs on my Kixify. Go check out all the pairs. Definitely, I mean, they're not in bad condition. Some of them are definitely worn, but go check it out. Um, I'm a trusted seller on Kixify. Uh, my Kixify store name is Bonafide Kicks. I'll put the link in the description. Definitely check it out. Great deals. Um, I'm willing to barter or negotiate prices on any of these pairs, so don't feel afraid to uh, ask me or offer me on an amount of money worst I can say is no uh, the way I see it um, unless you're a dick to me but <laughs> I don't even want to go there um, yeah worst I can say is no so just hit me up and uh, maybe I can hook you up with some nice shoes like these LeBron 4's those I might actually sell today some guys have been asking about those but uh, yeah definitely hit me up Super nice shoes. Um, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it and uh, comment and tell me what you think about all these shoes I have for sale. Super nice shoes. Um, and uh, follow my Instagram. I've, I've started really posting a lot of stuff on there. My Instagram is at MBSouls. But if you looked up MBSouls716, you'd be able to find it. And uh, yeah, that's about it. If you enjoyed, like I said, be sure to like the video and uh, be sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll, uh, I'll see you next time.